I wish to be turned to ash and thrown to the sea of Bredi. Let my family know. I have filled my head and heart with hope and hopped along from one hateful home to another. I have seen my own reflection in the window of the bubble I got myself trapped in. I have looked in the mirror and seen a monkey with spectacles. The doctor told me I had perfect vision. I have pushed my love deep into the well of my heart, then twisted my intestines into a well-tied rope and thrown it down for her to climb out. I have not quite undone the lot of my intestines. I have almost been forgiven. I have not appeared in court. I have let go of the electrified cable at the penultimate second. I have found solace in the salty sweat under my shirt. I have completed the circle and left it empty. I have chosen the open road. Bring on the peoples and the landscapes, the steppes, the high Himalayas, the hospitable and hostile voices, the rejuvenating unknown air, the welcoming water, the salty summer wind through the open windows, the ever unfolding maps, the nocturnal molluscines, the light rucksack of reason, the script sacred and profane, the erotic verses in twisted tongues, bring on the breeze wafting softly through the orange branches, bring on the surrogate grandmothers in villages far and wide, bring on the border police with their impeccable knowledge of geography, bring on the September rain to rinse the solitary streets of Luxembourgville, let the offices and libraries burn and my heart with them, let my blood turn to lead, my saliva to ink, my own and of those I meet along the road, let the ending speak for itself, my lips are almost sealed, keep your arms wide open my love, your skin as smooth as silk, your bosom warm, when my new nationless passport has no more pages left to stamp, I might be back. Thank you.